In this video, I'm going to show you how to download Optifine for Minecraft 1.21.4. The first thing you want to do is you want to open up the Minecraft launcher like you normally would. Once you're in the Minecraft launcher, the next thing you want to do is you want to make sure that Minecraft Job Edition is selected and then go to the version selector and select on latest release. So at the time of recording, Minecraft 1.21.4 is the latest release. So go ahead and select on that. However, if you're watching this video in the future, then what you need to do is you need to go over here to where it says installations, then go ahead and press on new installation like so. And then over here where it says versions, make sure you look up release 1.21.4 and then you can give this installation a name and a directory and stuff like that but anyways guys what you want to do is you want to make sure that 1.21.4 is selected and then you want to go ahead and press on play because before we're able to download any type of mods or anything we need to make sure that we do load into the game all right guys and as you're able to tell we do have minecraft 1.21.4 loaded in so once you're done with that you can go ahead and close out of minecraft like so and then the next thing you want to do is you want to open up any web browser such as google or whichever one you are most comfortable with all right guys the next thing you want to do is you want to go to the link in the description down below or in the pinned comment and then it will take you to a page that looks like this and over here it'll provide you the direct downloads for optifine and all the other tools you will need and this is also another written tutorial so if that's something you are interested in definitely go ahead and check it out so as you ever tell we already did step one which is open minecraft 1.21 and the next thing we need to do is we actually need to download optifine so all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on this blue link over here and then it will direct you to the Optifine website. From here, go to the top menu, select on downloads, and then go ahead and select on all versions. Then locate 1.21.4. It should be at the top. And at the moment, Optifine is uh, in its preview version, but you can still download it and it still will work. So anyways, guys, all you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and just press on download. I'm just going to be selecting on preview number two. So I'm just going to go ahead and press on download like this. And then all you want to do is you want to go to the top right and then press on this purple button that says skip. You may get some advertisements, but guys, make sure to not click on them. All right, guys, once you're done with that, all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on download once more, and then it will be installed and it should be in your downloads. Now, for clarity purposes, I'm actually going to go ahead and drag out my Optifine file to my desktop just so you guys are able to see things a bit easier, uh, but you could obviously find it in your downloads folder or anything like that. All right, once you're done with that, then you want to go back to the link that I did showcase previously. And then the next step will be to install Java. So all you want to do is you want to scroll down and then select on this link over here that says official Java website. And then it will take you to a website that looks something like this. From here, make sure that you do select on JDK21. Then go ahead and select on what operating system you're currently using. So I'm personally on a Windows. So I would go ahead and select on Windows and then install the X64 installer. And the reason why we actually need Java is because it will allow us to run like .jar files. And with that, we are actually able to run Optifine. And if for whatever reason you're running into any troubles, what you can do is you can go ahead and run the jar fix, which is basically like a executable command that should be able to fix any of your issues. So all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on this link over here. And then you want to go ahead and just press on jarfix.exe. And you can run that in order to fix any of your issues in Java. But this is only if you experience any problem. So yeah, hopefully things should be pretty straightforward. Anyways, guys, then you just want to minimize out this window. And then you want to go ahead and locate the Optifine file that you did download previously and if you did download java successfully you will notice that the file icon will kind of look like a coffee so that's honestly pretty cool but anyways guys all you want to do from here is you want to right click on it like so then you want to go ahead and select on open with and then java tm platform se binary should appear over here and you just want to go ahead and press on it like so and then it is going to give you a menu that looks like this it is going to tell you where in your device it is going to download it you just want to go ahead and press on install and if we did everything correctly, it should say that Optifine is successfully installed. So from here, go ahead and just press on OK. The next thing you want to do is you want to open up the Minecraft launcher once more. All right, guys, and then when you do load in, you should notice that it will automatically change our version to Optifine for 1.21.4, which it did for me right over here. However, if you're running into issues, what I suggest you do is you go over here to where it says installations and then go towards this section that says versions. And you want to make sure that all three of these checkboxes are turned on because this is actually considered a modded version of Minecraft. So make sure that the box that says modded is turned on and then you guys can go ahead and select on new installation. And then where it says versions, you can go ahead and locate Optifine 1.21.4 right over here. And you could obviously give it a name and a game directory. But anyways, guys, all you want to do is you want to go over here to the 
installation section over here. And if we did everything correctly, you should notice that Optifine for Minecraft 1.21.4 will appear right over here. And all you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on this green button that says play. And then it is going to give you a page that looks like this. All you want to do is you want to go ahead and press on I understand and then press on play again. And now it will begin to load in Minecraft 1.21.4 with Optifine. All right, guys. And as you're able to tell, it will now say Minecraft 1.21.4. And then in parentheses, it will say modded. So that is how you know you did the right thing. So all you want to do from here is you want to go ahead and load into any Minecraft world or server. And then you should notice significant performance boosters. All right, guys. And here we are in our Minecraft world. And we are getting a decent amount of FPS, around like 100 FPS. So that is definitely pretty cool. And it does showcase the power of Optifine. And Optifine is definitely one of those mods like where you really need to download it because you're able to run a bunch of different mods, shaders, texture packs, all that good stuff. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe as we are trying to reach 300 subscribers by the end of the year. Please like, comment, subscribe. See you later, french fries.